Hello everybody. You may remember a few weeks ago I said I was going to start doing newcomer gameplay sessions on my Twitch streams on Wednesdays. Um, so I started doing that recently and we had a great session uh, just this last week. So I threw together some gameplay, cut it up a little bit so it's not so boring and uh, basically gave you guys about an hour and a half of footage to see what it's like to play Star Citizen as a newcomer and see what the game's all about. So uh, I hope you guys enjoy and if you are a newcomer yourself or you haven't played the game yet or you just started, feel free to hop into our Discord in the video description and you can also try this out with me. Come come join me on Twitch, come play with us and uh, let me know what you think of this footage in the comments. My, my tomato diet is more subdued. Okay. <laughs> Not a ravenous tomato fiend? No, like, no. Like I said, I've only just started to be okay with them, so I'm, I'm still working it up. Um, let's see. So we're going to do some trading. What ships have you seen? Um, I mean, I pulled a lot of them out with the free thing, you know? But not not too many, man. I think I've seen like maybe half of the ones on the free, and that's it. That's about it. I saw. I did see one guy with the caterpillar. That was crazy. I didn't even know what it was. I had. Uh, I was freaked out. I had to move my ship off the landing pad. I was like, "What the f bro?" Well, we are going to do a caterpillar now. Oh, sick. <laughs> we are going to pad beta zero zero over here. Did you need any weapons or anything? Do you already have everything you need? Looks like you got a you got a mining laser sticking out of your thigh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got a little pistol. I think All I right. need some food and water. But really, are you like dehydrated or? It's at like thirty nine percent. Oh I'm yeah, sure you're gonna like... need some like now. Although it's I don't like know if there is any here. We might have to fly to a rest yeah. stop for you. All right, <sighs> tell you what. We'll make a pit stop at a rest stop because um, we're it's flying all the way to Hurston. So we can just stop on the it, way there. That's cool. Yeah, I mean, we could probably just make it all the way there and, and get it. I won't, I won't die. I died of thirst yesterday. <laughs> I know how much time I have left. <laughs> that is uh, one of the more honorable <laughs> ways to die. And you also have the choice of... Uh, getting caught in a door, flaw falling through the planet, <laughs> falling through the city, or losing your helmet spontaneously while you're in space. So, you know, dying from that thirst. A little more realistic. <laughs> death. Yeah. Harbinger and uh, Zero, thank you guys both for joining us here on the garden. Once or twice. What was that? I have fallen through the world once or twice. Can you oh, yeah. Me? Okay, is my, is my yeah, no, no, no. Point. Sorry, I was talking to Twitch. <laughs> oh, you're good. Oh, yeah. What up, Twitch? <laughs> I should uh, tune into your stream. Here, I'll do it from my phone. You can get food views. and water at Port Alizar? Huh. I didn't know that. Always down to support the Twitch YouTube dream. Thank you. Well, this is the Caterpillar. Uh, she's a wow. complex beast. It's very convoluted how to get to the cockpit, but once you learn it, it gets super easy. Um, you can explore as much as you want while we're flying, because it's a pretty big ship. There's a lot to see. I'll just take yeah. us off and get us on our way. This is nuts. Yeah, and this you, is a very you cool ship. ship with, like, in -game credits? Oh, no, no, no. This is a uh, free fly ship. Oh, so, okay, I, wow. yeah, I don't... I just, today's the last day I have this ship. Ah, I see. <laughs> so I've been using it to rake up some uh, cargo hauling money until I can't do it anymore. And then I might buy it in game actually because it's very useful. And I generally have no other way of making money. Like I do some bounty hunting, but it's not really my thing. Um, cargo hauling yeah. is, is, is pretty fun. Like it's boring, but it's fun. I know what you mean, man. I did that, like I said, I did that in GTA Online. I fucking I had so much money in that game. And all, and you know, all, this, that's just like constant. The tr yeah, so in, is, is there like a 
good like trading routes because like that that's like the thing that i got into in like gta was like i would line up all my deliveries you know what i'm saying yeah uh, i'm about to uh whoa did somebody just hit us oh no that was weird <laughs> <laughs> that just reminded me of that of the original halo i don't know if you ever played the first halo and yeah. the, uh, the marine is like Whoa, did something just hit us? Move in, back oh, to the yeah. airlock. Yeah, it's like every time something hits me, I always think of that line. Why is this saying it's obstructed? It's not obstructed. Um, yeah, no, I'm about to show you a great cargo uh, cargo hauling route. Oh my God, it, you can make so much money off of this. Although because it's so good, sometimes pirates camp it out. So you gotta be a little bit careful. It's good to have like an escort or somebody in the turrets. I see. But that's kind of oh, yeah. where the game is going. So um, the idea behind Star Citizen, it, the thing I always tell people is like, it's very much based on player choice, risk and reward. Uh, eventually it's going to be a place, so they have green zones now, but like in this next update coming up, they're removing green zones around rest stops. So weapons are free for vehicles. And it's basically the idea of, well, you have the choice of using those weapons if you really want to, but you're gonna get scraped by the system if you do and so the overall goal is that trade routes um mining claims places where you want to put an outpost down all these places are going to be valuable because everybody wants them and because everybody wants them pirates are going to know that people want them they're going to stay around those areas and try and get people so like it sort of creates this gameplay loop of I want to trade these valuable goods, but because they're valuable, pirates want to get me. Because pirates want to get me, I'm going to hire a hired escort. Because I have hired escorts, I need to make more money to pay them, so I need to make sure I'm getting the highest value cargo. And it, like, it creates sort of that, like exactly what you're talking about with GTA. Like it creates a whole economy that's based on the gameplay that people are taking part in. That's kind of what I'm excited about with this game. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It, that, that, like, the way that they handle because honestly like people they, they call it grief i mean it is griefing like it's it's a real thing but like you know for the most part i feel like it does incentivize that gameplay loop where you get to yeah like everything you just said which sounds really fun you know it's like i would who wouldn't want to play a game like that yeah but you know it's it's pretty phenomenal and, and and that's part of why people are so impatient because it sounds so good it is taking a long time and it's like I just want to enjoy that you know but it's it's part of the process in order to get there you gotta you gotta put it together first yeah yeah I mean and of course you gotta have the player base like participate but I mean this game's still around after like seven years. Yeah. I don't know. Seven years of <laughs> development and still kicking. Still kicking hard. Yeah. Thing, it is. You, the thing you buy to just be like, I have way more money yeah. than you. Yeah. And it's literally, I mean, the way they built it was so that you can ferry around really rich people as a job and like host oh. big, sort of like. You ever play Elite Dangerous? No, they have these they have these times so in elite dangerous you can like jump into a system and it'll you'll have like an uh, open comms for the whole system that's basically like okay here's what everybody in this area is saying and sometimes you'll jump into a system and you'll hear you'll get like a text comm that's supposed to be coming from the captain of a ship saying something like oh this is your captain speaking we're currently cruising through this system um please join please please go here on the ship right now for this party or whatever like that it's like flavor text basically but whenever i think of the 890 jump gameplay i always think of that i'm like somebody's going to be hosting a literal touring cruise on this ship and just have a bunch of rich people on board that they have to keep safe and they're going to get paid like hundreds of thousands of uec for that yeah that's like i mean 
that's one of those things where do you really think that that's realistically going to happen like Absolutely. what is what is the rich people's incentive to sit there other than of course flexing on people which like i'm not going to say people wouldn't do occasionally i know for a fact they will based <laughs> off of play, no, no, playing no. on GTA online i know for a fact that flexing on people is a perfectly valid reason to do stuff in an mmo but like <laughs> Other than that, you know what I'm saying? What's going to make people want to sit in a room and chat? You know, I don't right? think like, it's going to be... I think it's mostly going to be NPCs. They'll just oh. have, like, super rich NPCs that pay players, and then, like, you'll get bonuses or you'll get deductions based on how well you completed this quote-unquote mission. I see. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Ah, uh, that would be awesome. Because then they could get this huge... Yo, that would be sick. Because yeah. they could give these huge Alpha UAC rewards or, you know, contracts out. And then yeah. they could hire private security. Right. You would have to have security. You'd have to have, to have an escort. Uh, yeah. All that stuff. The one thing you're missing out on is that GTA is filled with a bunch of 16-year-old kids that are looking to... Oh, I'm not... <laughs> kids. I'm not and missing out on that. <laughs> with a bunch of, like, you know, not, like, saying I'm... this in a mean way, but, like definitely older than me oh i'm a long shot yeah yeah the, the star citizen community is older yeah, in general no. which is good also there's not the game breaking pc hacks that there is in gta online yeah is... and i'm hoping they stay on top of that i really do because the, <laughs> if people are able to like really exploit the glitches in this game holy crap that'd be that'd be some big issues because the glitches, the glitches well, in this game are crazy, and there's permadeath. You just send somebody through a wall into an airlock, and they die and lose one of their eight lives or whatever. Wow. That's crazy. But I Yo. think they'll stay on top of that. Yeah, for sure. All right, so we're going to stop off at this space station here. They basically they have these rest stop space stations scattered throughout the system which is kind of like a pit stop like if you need weapons food a place to log off um components some weapons you can only get at these stations um so it's worth kind of checking them out every once in a while but they're everywhere and these are the places where they're going to stop locking people's weapons down oh uh, so these are going to be they're yeah, basically going to be like it, it, it will be kind of a risk to go here it really just depends on who's playing because most people are going to be like right. yeah i don't want to get shot by weapons that are literally bigger than my ship the, sh the weapons they're putting on these space stations are going to be massive um but then you're also going to have people yeah. who are like this is why i'm playing the game i want some combat fun i want to fight a space station and then it's like okay well yeah. are you going to be unlucky enough to get caught uh, up in that Exactly. Are you going to be on the server when the pirate clan decides to bring their fucking whatever over? <laughs> and it's kind of like that station all day. It's kind of like I think for the first probably patch that it's released, it might be a little iffy. They might there. There's going to be some issues with the system, just like with the prison system. I think it's going to take like a, a solid patch for it to like really settle down, people to get used to it stop trying to challenge the space stations to fights and all that kind of stuff and then it'll start to be more normal because they put in the prison system into the game earlier this year and immediately everybody was like i'm gonna get arrested and go escape from prison and it took like two weeks and then everybody was like oh my god i don't want to go to prison ever again <laughs> <laughs> so it just it just takes some time yeah i'm not interested in going to jail in this game no, it's it's not fun. You legit can't play for two weeks. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's never that long, thank God. But like you, you could get a, a few hours here and there. Um, the nice part is that like you can do missions in there, you can mine, and it'll lower the time. But it also sometimes glitches, so you could get stuck there for a long time for no reason. So. Hey, fun fact, I'm actually probably in jail right now. <laughs> <clears throat> I got the game with one crime stat. That sucks. <laughs> well, at least that shouldn't, shouldn't be too long. 
Beefy Pog, Mr. Beefy, how are you doing today? Thank you for joining the garden. Thank you for jumping in with us, joining the community. I was calling the poor O to get on it. I'm pretty sure if you get shot by one of the turrets, you get a crime stat. I was accidentally shot by one, and I got a crime stat. Well, that's weird. He was shooting at the person next to me. All right, we're going to the food court because you need yourself a burrito, my friend. Yeah, sounds great. I ran around one space station for like 20 minutes. There was nowhere to buy food on the whole f***ing state. I was like, what the f***? Yeah, they've got to... They've got to uh, get the signage working better. I mean, even I get lost. I don't even know if we're heading towards the food court right now. We might not. Nope, we're not. Other way. I mean, a, a universe full of vending machines. <laughs> none of, <laughs> none them, of work. them work. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's... Uh, <sighs> Could really use more functional vending machines here. Reminds me of middle well, school. I just like think about it. They had a bunch of think vending machines and I couldn't use them. Time that would take. It's like two animations: one for the green machine, one for the red machine, and a menu. One and thing then, I've like, every vending machine in the whole game would work. I feel like that's like something you would spend like a day on just just cause. One thing I've discovered have. with this game is if it's something that I think is going to be easy, there's probably like 20 steps that make it not easy. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, they're probably gonna, they're probably have it working. They're just waiting for some other system to tie it into or something. That's, that's usually the case. All right, uh, yeah. you thirsty or hungry? What do you need? Uh, both. I'll buy a burrito and, oh, here we go, I see. Vestal water. That sounds good. It's decent. Some of that. It's got a oh, decent about? alkaline level. What am I supposed to, oh. When I have left. it's Mechdor in chat. Give me hey, man, drink. How's it going? Good oh, morning, okay. Cynical Syndrome. How you doing? Wait, How's your guys Wednesday going? Guys, we still don't have our emotes. <sighs> so sad. YouTube approved them within like two hours. Oh, God. <laughs> What's up? What's going on? I don't know. Oh, here we go. How do I drink it? Oh, here it is. Yeah, and then when you click, click drink, just click and hold down the button. Oh, I gotta remove oh. my helmet. Oh, yeah, huh? <laughs> Give me a drink, is. So, uh, is this one water gonna do it for me, or do I need more? You might need, yeah, I don't know, man. Depends on, uh, depends on you. I see. I don't know how much water you like with your, with your soup. It's true. Thank you for teaching me. And I guess I should get a food thing too. Can I buy this burrito? Yeah, man, get a burrito. I want the display burrito though. Can I guarantee, oh, can you guarantee I'm... that it will be this burrito on the display right here? I this can guarantee <laughs> that it will be cold and stale and probably disgusting. But if you want to subject your character to that, go right ahead. That's the fuck uh, you can't about. actually buy this one. That's unfortunate. I know, you can't. It's That's actually probably so fortunate. Rough. Oh, dude, did you just eat that with the wrapper on it? Yeah, just dude. ate the foil and everything. Yeah, <laughs> <Shout out, bro. laughs> Obviously very hungry. Do you need uh, a more? Uh, I guess, can I, can I save them? Can I buy like, uh, I think you can Fuck put it, it in your... Uh, I don't no, think you can uh, put it in your backpack. I don't know. Back it's, it's too much trouble for me to get fussed with right now. Next patch yeah, in the next month or so. We'll have like the inventory system actually working. Then you can, yeah, you can put it in your backpack, take it to the ship, put it in the ship, save it on there, all that jazz. Fill up your fridge, whatever you want to do. That's <laughs> funny when I was dying of thirst in my ship, looking at a sink. I was like, God, damn it, <laughs> <laughs> I can't figure out how to turn it on. <laughs> uh. Oh, uh, throw your helmet back on. Is it not? You I might have, if you did it, then it's just going to take a while to update. All good. Yeah, it's all right. I already have it on. It's just going to do it in a second. Meanwhile, you can look at my sweet hair. Oh. That's a nice cut, man. <laughs> oh, man. I wish I had hair you like went for that. You uh, went for the low, <laughs> low definition comb over, huh? <laughs> yeah, exactly. 
bartend bar barbers like how do you want your hair this week and you're like ah give me that low poly look <laughs> yeah exactly like a pixelated blocky <laughs> let's go make some money i love money <laughs> how much do you have right now uh, I have made in playing this game for like 10 hours, like 61,000. Oh, that's not bad. Which I I didn't reach 100,000 UEC until like three weeks ago, maybe. And I've had this game for six years. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's just never, <laughs> ever tried to earn any money. I see. <laughs> Where's the turrets? I don't know how to get in the uh, turrets. There's one in the front, all uh, the way in the very front, and then there's one in the back, I think. Yeah, there's one in the back somehow. I don't know how you... I think you have to get into a, the support seat, and it's like a remote turret. Ah, uh, okay. Ooh. Remote. Sounds fancy. Let's see what... Let, let's see what it do. Oh. This doesn't look functional right now. Okay. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, you have to power it on. Ah, this game's crazy. Whoa. Oh, it has a tractor beam. Yeah, this ship has a tractor beam. Doesn't work yet, but it has it. Awesome. This this little tractor beam cabin area is awesome too. I put a jacuzzi in here if this was my ship. Just strip this part out, put the jacuzzi in here. <laughs> Just get. This is the, uh, you don't want a jacuzzi if you're flying Drake, man. You sound more like a RSI or Origin guy. I mean, I did draw, I did buy an Origin, so. Oh, yeah, huh? Don't know if you could fit a jacuzzi in the 315, though. That would be I a tight fit. It. It'd be like a, a one foot jacuzzi. You gotta wash one limb at a time. Oh, the trick is you gotta put the hot plate in your sink. You ah, can't there you sit go. In there. Yeah, 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 yeah. You just kind of <laughs> scoop the water out and dump it on yourself. <laughs> My thing with the origin is like, okay, like it, it looks great and I love it, but like the sh the space, sh the door doesn't close when I'm taking a shit. So it's like as soon as I take my space, it's just gonna my whole ship's gonna smell like shit. It's only like, <laughs> you know. No man, it's it's origin. They have that uh, they have that bespoke, exclusive, air purifying system. Oh, that's right. How could I forget? Replace the cargo bay with the bathtub. <laughs> <laughs> Garuka, how's it going, man? How you doing? Center, hallway, how's your Wednesday? Upper hallway, command access, power plant, server access. Whoa. Whoa, this is a server room? What? Sorry, I'm just fanboying over your ship. Right? No, no, this that's all good. Uh, Do all the fanboying. This is, a, this, I can't believe they built Renewed a server sub? room. Thank you so this. much, Guga, Garuka. Uh, I appreciate like, that. That's the thing yeah, about look at you, you got the yellow tomato. Like, how Sweet. many ships? Thank you so much, Garuka. And the level of detail i don't even care the rest of it is just like okay but the level is the detail that they put in the ships i mean that's obviously why everyone's playing this game if you're playing this game i feel yeah, like yeah man the ships are the star of the game absolutely i mean a lot of people are here for like how the systems work together but like most of the systems don't work without the ships and the ships are just stupidly detailed yeah inside <sighs> and out like you cannot find that many games movies videos anything that really does that allows nice. you to explore ships so universally yeah they took this to a whole another level i mean right down to the rivets because I've, I've never seen rivets look good in a game but they make <laughs> these rivets look good yeah man that's <laughs> that uh tried and true rivet pipeline that they developed that's uh 80 million dollars went right there <laughs> oh, I am not in jail. Oh, well, that's nice. That's always something yeah, I like to wake up to. Home. Yeah, me too. You're oh, a PO? So how, how do you get rid of a crime stat? Uh, you gotta you hack it away, there. or... I think you can Isn't pay the fine. Pay? I don't know, I, I don't know if that's a crime stat kiosk or just a fine kiosk, but... You can give it a uh, shot. 
this actually does i know it's supposed to be the uh there's another ship in this game that's supposed to be the nostromo yeah the really? uh reclaimer the reclaimer and that thing it dude see okay so here's here's something about this game that's interesting there's clearly a lot of uh inspiration from other sci-fi projects in this game and like some people treat that as such a bad thing like oh there's nothing original here but there's plenty of original in this game i love that they also are able to include so much stuff that kind of harkens back to other sci-fi projects that they know their fans love like you can see you can see stuff like uh the like i see halo when i look at both the uh the valkyrie and the cyclone like the cyclone looks kind of like a warthog you see yeah. alien and the valkyrie definitely looks a lot like a pelican yeah it at least has that same sort of like design language you see um oh gosh you see halo frigate design language when you look at the the larger capital ships in this game you see alien when you look at the reclaimer um you see star trek when you look at the rsi mantis and it's like it's cool because we also love that stuff a lot and like they've got their own designs and stuff but it's it's cool to see that kind of stuff replicated here as well yeah you see the millennium falcon and the mercury star runner i mean they use that literally as their inspiration yeah. oh uh heads up by the way this moon is super hot and yeah, I gotta get out of yeah when you're in the turret <laughs> There's no air conditioning, so <laughs> you'll get burned. Uh, yeah, I was listening to what you're saying, then I like got in the turret and I was like, "Oh, I'm going to die." <laughs> <laughs> That's happened to me. <laughs> that happened to me the hard. I, I learned that the hard way. Uh... You can also. I don't know if you've seen if you like keep up with the weekly progress of this project or anything, um, but they've been showing off some of their like kind of villages and outposts that they're doing um and it looks like very star wars-esque and it's just another thing that you're like that looks so much like something i've seen before but they have a slight twist on it and it looks so good yeah i'm like okay so so what if they do borrow from all of your favorite star like oh uh, you know another thing is like the uh the gladius um and what is the other one? God, there's one ship. Uh, it's like one of the first ones. It's a oh. Vandal. The Vandal, one of the Vandals. And, the, and I'm mm -hmm. like, okay, this is Battlestar Galactica, like 100%. The most oh, yeah, 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 yeah. is 100%. The, yeah, the, the, the Glaive. Yeah, the Glaive. The Glaive looks a lot like the uh, Cylon ship from Battlestar Galactica. Hey, what's up, guys? How you guys doing? Hey. Good man. Hellgast, how's it going? Yo, just chilling. I'm trying to trying to get some footage for a video that I'm doing. Let's, oh, let's okay. Listen. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So we are going to hop out and go fill up the ship with some cargo. Um, we just got to move. I mean, we we don't have to move super quick because you won't burn up in like a minute. But probably shouldn't stay outside too long. And there's oh, armor. Shit. You streaming? Yeah, Sorry, I am. No, 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 you're fine. Um, yeah. and there's armor that you can get that'll actually protect you on these kinds of planets. You can get armor for super hot areas and armor for super cool areas. So I got like ten. Oh wow, I got an hour and nineteen minutes. Okay, yeah, that's not bad. I wonder if it's morning or something. No, it's middle of the day. That's crazy. It sh it'll keep going up. It's like 230 <laughs> degrees Celsius here. Speedy G's in waiting room. All right. Okay, yeah. Bring him in. So what are you guys doing right now? Uh, we're doing some cargo hauling. I'm just showing him the game. Uh, he's kind of new. Not, not, not brand new, but kind of new. Um, so I'm showing him what there is to do in the game and what's fun and what's not. Also, how to yeah. eat some food. <laughs> Alrighty, so this specific station 
sells something very valuable called Laronite. And it also sells titanium. Oh, yeah. And everywhere that you go has different prices for this stuff, like a normal thing, right? So we can buy as much as we want of this stuff. The transaction failed. Insufficient stock. Oh, uh, what? What do you mean insufficient <sighs> stock? Buy them out. Yeah, except they're supposed to just give me what they have. That's weird. Okay, we're going to do titanium instead then. So you can get pretty good prices here. It depends on kind of the time of the day. Um, but you can get good prices here. So we're going to put 430,000 down. And we should be able to sell this for about 550, maybe, uh, at a city. Since we're way out here in the middle of nowhere, they're selling titanium for fairly cheap. And when we go into the city, where obviously they need titanium for a lot of stuff, they're going to buy it for more expensive. And that's kind of the beginning of the dynamic economy they're working on. Eventually, this is going to actually react much more realistically and in real time to various aspects of the game on all sorts of levels at all space stations and stuff. Um, so this is kind of our first experience with it, but it's nice to be able to find a good trading route that like has those prices that you can really take advantage of and use it to make a lot of money you can actually there's a couple websites that you can use uh to find the best routes too or just like find out what you should trade at the station that you find yourself at yeah cool wow so what were you talking 430, about Hundred and thirty thousand. that's crazy oh yo oh, galag okay, so uh, logistics. Yeah, now the ship is full of stuff. So you can use Galog Logistics to like look up what prices are at what places, what 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 places are buying those items, like all that kind what of stuff. What ship are you guys in right now? Uh, we're running cool. a Caterpillar. Sheesh. Yeah, yeah, it's filled to the brim. We got a lot of stuff on us right now. So. God, that's so cool that it fills up. I just like. What, the caterpillar? Yeah, uh, my nerd bone is strong right now, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually, I'm cheesing right now, bro. I'm like, yes. The, uh, <laughs> what they plan on doing is actually having you load the ships manually. Um, but, <laughs> but, you can easily pay a service to have, obviously, NPCs do it for you. But you're going to have to oh. wait either way. So it's not going to so be you're instant. Gonna, you're going to see some oh, NPCs cool. just rocking up, you, like, just grabbing boxes and putting it on the shelves that's stuff. the plan yeah i mean or, they'll or probably use it, trolleys just... but the trolleys. they've already got them uh, working they mentioned in the last the monthly system. report that they've got they've been working on the trolley systems to be able to transport multiple boxes at once from station to ship that's really cool yeah that caterpillar is really cool it's a weird ass ship you ever seen two caterpillars smash into each other? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, can't see I seen that one. Oh. Well, I have, and that was pretty cool. Sounds like a uh, sight to behold. Yeah, it is. It is. It's very beautiful. It's pretty <laughs> I'm in the right. thing. I'm <laughs> sorry. I'm going to go grab some food, my guy. Oh, what you right. getting, brother? Bro, I don't even know, okay? I don't know what's in my fridge. <laughs> Alright, man. I'll be back. Take it easy. <laughs> Alrighty. Oh, shit, I'm gonna die in this still. Yeah. That was too cold. Uh, yeah, we're gonna get out of atmosphere soon, so you'll be safe. Oh, okay. That's <laughs> fun, man. So we're so we're taking it so right now we're at where? We're at Ariel, which is a moon around the planet Hurston. And we're going to we're going to hurston hurston okay basically oh, moon sweet. outpost to main city and hurston is kind of like a wasteland planet honestly they the people who the corporation who bought it hurston dynamics like did, just did not care about it tested weapons dumped trash did all this stuff and so now like the whole planet is just disgusting for the most part it's like acid pools and trash heaps and just like desert it's it's not a great planet but there's a ton of industry around it so you can make a lot of money 
which is what we're gonna do. Cool. Yeah, I, I was. This is where I spawned. Oh, okay. I spent a lot. I spent a lot of time here. Oh, we're getting scanned by security. Ah, uh, for contraband. Yeah, but we've just got some good, good titanium. We're law-abiding citizens. Please, sir. Some normal goods here. You, you there are ships though that have like smuggling secret hideaways where you can smuggle stuff. Like you can carry cargo and then have like something illegal that you keep under the floorboards. So even if they come on your ship, they might not find it. I mean, I, like for me, I'm, I'm also interested in the, uh, if they ever, I mean, who knows when they'll get around to that, but like, I'm assuming it'll be like well, the last thing that they do put into the game. Do so, what? Probably never have it, but <laughs> the exploration uh, type deal. Like, I really like the idea that they have with the. I, I heard. I was watching a couple of videos about this, like information brokers and so on. You know, where yeah. you would go out and scout locations, find like mines and and other types of you know resource deposits, bring that information back to an NPC that would give you out the UAC, UEC and sell that to actual players. That is uh, my planned role. <laughs> I actually, I actually just made a YouTube video about exploration a, a few weeks ago, maybe a month or two ago. Um, I think exploration might be coming in some form within like the next year. I think oh. it'll actually be coming sooner um, than I previously thought at least, because they're working on the new scanning system, they're working on the new radar, and the new star map, and with that they're, they're going to take advantage of that by placing new points of interest and in places in uh, in the game. And when they usually, at this point, when they're working on systems, they tend to do it in a way that it's going to hit as many topics as they can with that one rework. So when they work the star map and the scanning system, I'm almost certain that they're also going to be working on the waypoint system and uh, the ability to place waypoints. And if they can if you can place waypoints, that right there is your your method of selling locations. So I certainly yeah, think that exactly. there might be a possibility of exploration gameplay uh, actually being in the game in the next like year, maybe year and a half. It'd be so it'd be so much fun with that with with my ship. It's just like fly in, you know, it's a pretty small ship, not a lot of weapons, pretty fast, pretty stealthy. Go in to like a, a crazy you know area, find a couple of rare deposits yeah get out of there sell yeah. the way to some player for like 50k or something you know <laughs> that's why i got the terrapin it's like this defensive dedicated scanning ship that has had absolutely no use for like the four years it's been out uh, three years it's been out um so i can't wait <laughs> it's a really cool looking ship it's like a turtle yeah it is <laughs> Lorville is I'm not a fun place out. to land at, and they're closing the doors on us. Of course. Yeah, that's what I hate about this dock, man. Yep. Every time. Yep. It's very Every annoying. And then they don't reopen it. Yeah, you, you have don't. to call them again. And they get all sassy saying, oh, you, I already uh, authorized you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, we've we, 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 already put that call in. Shut <laughs> up. Yeah, dude, come on. Don't close the door on me. <laughs> and then my Drake is like, sold enough. Because Alf is inside, Alf is outside. Thank you very much. <laughs> the end. Uh, that's fun. You guys are funny. How many tractor beams are on this thing? I think there's three. Oh, there are hey, two or three. Guys? I sort of snuck into the stream. <laughs> no problem, no problem. Space tomato, why do we get on this train? Uh, we gotta go to the business center to sell our stuff. Are you guys going to the business district? Yeah. Oh, Looking like Anvil Carrick is gonna win the, uh, dip showdown. I could've... I could've predicted Boo. that. I was like, I need to get started on a Carrick cinematic. So they just have like gold statues of Lenin here, and no one. <laughs> Does that not look smack like Lenin to you? 
Wait, so like, if the Carrick wins the ship showdown, like, what happens? He's got a little more hair, but like... Uh, I believe they they release new skins for the Carrick. Or something like that. I'm honestly, I don't know. I don't follow the ship, like, those things very much. So don't take my word for it. All I know is that, uh... The free fly ends this week, or today. So I guess oh, what? the- They're closing the fire? They're closing the hangar on me. What? The Lorville. Government property, no trespassing. Thanks. And honestly, like, it, it's funny because it's a glitch, but it works so well in the lore for the Hurstons and, and Lorville. It's just like, they do not <laughs> they care about you. Like, oh, the door shut? Yeah, okay. It's like the DMV of a planet. That's what it's <laughs> really like to me. <laughs> okay. Or like in, in Men in Black, that like shady back room where the coffee drinking aliens were. Alrighty, here we go. We are going to yeah. sell. I'm putting in, I'm guessing, about 430,000, 440,000. Let's see how much we made. Yo, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll throw you my 60,000 so you can buy more stuff. We, we, we made 500,000. No, I, I, I can buy the whole freaking outpost. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> HD does suck. Er, sir, so we'll be, we'll, we'll be making profit I like completely agree. Uh, we made 170,000 profit. I say we, but you've done literally everything. <laughs> <laughs> Your emotional support, man. <clears throat> hey, thanks, man. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm saying I can throw 60, 60 grand. I can give you so you so I can have some skin in the game, make some money while you make some money. Uh, or I could just give you some of the money that we just made. I mean, yeah, but like, you know, <laughs> I, I'm, what I'm saying. Oh, thank you, man. Wow. Yeah, man. Now you can like, I don't know, buy tw exciting. two of whatever you're going to buy me for. <laughs> <laughs> What we can do is like we can make a, um, well, like I was a, a group to, I don't know, like deliver this into that space. I have my Drake here. You have your Drake there. I mean, we can do a trading convoy. Some escort. Yeah. And you can make a ton of money. Uh, would you like to fly can, escort? Yeah, I was about to say I can fly es escort and All I right. can. I, Nothing, so here's my thing. Nothing would make me happier than to turn this $70,000 you just gave me into more money. So if I can give you back the money to reinvest into the trading while I protect you guys. I will consider your protection the investment. Okay, yeah, fair enough. Actually, the, the convoy I pays the for the escort, not the escort pays for the, for the deliveries. Uh, I know, but I'm also basically just being... You know what? No, I'll just roll with it. Thank you, guys. I'm excited. <laughs> hey, man, if we get attacked, the, it, it's your <laughs> responsibility, so <laughs> don't don't say you're not working. Uh, not. I know. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try... Uh, I guess I'll get the, the Gladius out. All right. I don't want to use my it's garbage. I'm still landing, so I still have to sell it. Oh, but... okay. Sure, sure. Um, all right, so we'll get Can two get caterpillars. Central business district? Yeah. Cool. Do you have enough money to buy a full cargo load of titanium? So here's the thing, man. Uh, I actually haven't done any trading in this game. That's oh, no. actually the one thing I haven't done any. Yeah, man. Of, well, so... well, you could join us. I was asking Speedy G, though. Cause he's got a oh, he's got his caterpillar. Yeah, Speedy, do you have enough to buy a, a hold of titanium? How much is it? Probably gonna be about what was it, four hundred thirty thousand? Oh no, I have like a hundred or something. All right, I can give you some more money. Um, and then thirty k I can throw in, basically. Yep. I think I just got uh, a landing pad that's too small for my ship. So <laughs> I'm gonna try. Me and, and him, we, we wave at each other, we say hi, Don't and you just go and stare off. at their ass. <laughs> Is this how you introduce yourself to new people? <laughs> nice wave ass, to the man. man. How do I wait? Oh, yeah, yeah, right. No! Oh, he and he's, but he just ran into the... Okay, he disappeared. 
he just ran into the wall did that happen for you too he just combusted i don't what the fuck? okay well he's gone uh let's go back to the ships can't say i god i need to dang it i already messed up me uh, need to okay. change the Minus one. the points I'm going for that one take it back okay hangar one see you in space i'm at hangar one i will uh i'll follow I'm you out five. you guys want to pile in here i can do the elevators for you which uh Whoa. it's oh, fine got one. it'll be faster okay. if we just, That's all right. I'll yeah, just take each go well, you picked such a hard word, man. Sometimes how am I not? Just ah. ages to spawn, but it looks like they're coming how, the right now. So. How, how am how am me not supposed to say that? There's a, a way to join in convoy, right? Or uh, yes, could just say it in Turkish. Like fly in convoy or information in this case. What would the punishment be for saying a banned word? Yeah, that's kind know. of important. I don't. I, <laughs> dang it. I've Me never don't know. With multiple people before. Holy crap! This, be this one's hard. Excited to take this Gladius out for the last day that I get a chance to, though. How are you gonna ban? Thing sexy. That word. <laughs> Although. They gave me too big a hanger. It, it looks like a. Fucking, it just looks like a fighter jet. You know, and what's so special about that? It, like it's still pretty. It's, a lot. it's still pretty. Yeah, it's. I think it's a really good looking ship. I like the interior of it, interior a lot too, and they pulled the animations from Squadron Forty Two for the, like the startup and stuff, so it looks really cool. Uh, yeah, the interior is pretty awesome. Oh, that is it, awesome! It I did definitely. Not know they had a Thing. That's cool. It definitely feels the most finished yeah. when you get in yeah. it because of that Squadron 42 aspect. Oh, Wait, did I just leave the party? Or was that your party invite? Hmm? You didn't leave the party, you're still in it. Okay, good. I don't know. Community's got to choose what the punishment's going to be for saying a banned word. Me don't know. Uh, do you guys just want to meet up outside atmosphere or... Yeah, let's just meet in orbit. Cool. All right, I'm up and away. Holy crap, and we're already at the point where I need to run another ad. See you guys. This is ridiculous. Three ads a, an hour is a lot. I see you chugging up there. <laughs> so wait, we've got... Going as fast as I can. One. As Two. fast as me can. Jesus. You're doing it, Space Tomato. You hit the upper atmosphere. You're zooming now. Ah, oh, there it is. The caterpillar. Majestic. That is my alarm for another ad. Absolutely crazy. I'm not running another one yet. I mean, me, me not running enough. I need an actual incentive. Me needs an actual incentive to not say this word. All right, me is up with the corporal. Shut up. Yeah, I'm gonna go over to Speedy and hang out with him because I think uh, I've got space to mount. All right. Where's Speedy? Oh, he's still down a little bit. Yeah. Yep. He's going up pretty quick now. Ten thousand now. Ooh, straight shot to aerial. Is that where we're going? So how does this yep. work in terms of like me protecting you? during jumps and shit do i just go to aerial too or how does that work uh so as the party leader i can i can spool the jump drive and calibrate me can spool the jump drive and calibrate and you can just uh and you can just uh calibrate as well 
and then me will launch the quantum jump, and we will go together. Uh, hmm. points to I all. So I just press B when you guys press B, or? Nope, I press B for all of us. Me okay. press B for all of us. Hey, it's been eight minutes, okay. so I don't have to do it anymore. <laughs> but points Thank to all players, turns. yeah, that might be a thing. I might do that. Every time okay. me mess up. So where are you guys? 500 points. Except it's above. It's over now because it's right a five minute ban. Right now. And it's been eight minutes. So, ha. I passed. I didn't pass. I, I failed I'll horribly. But, my, uh, my radar. We'll just say I passed. Oh, gotcha. Hi. <laughs> oh, I see you. <laughs> I'm gonna ram you. Oh god. <laughs> okay, I have somebody on my right. No. Uh, it's me, I'm behind you. Oh, I can see it on I can I can only see you on my radar. I just scan real quick. Will that reveal like other people's ships, the scans, or no? Yeah, if they're within range. Cool. Oh my god! Sorry, I just fired a shot. That was my bad. <laughs> no, you almost into flew into me. Uh, dude, I like lost track of you and I heard your engines and I was like, that's not good. I started pressing space. <laughs> I was just like, go up, <laughs> go up. Fly ahead, scout out the landing zone. Looking good. Nobody here, huh? Nope. Usually at least somebody here. Well, My specs are a i7-9700K like processor, 32 gigabytes that of like... RAM, slow RAM. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna stay in the air. Uh, a GTX 1080 Ti no ATC on this one, game right? installed on an SSD. Nah, and I'm playing so at 1440p. And I'm streaming. And I'm recording. So just checking. I'm putting a pretty heavy load on my stuff. And and they're doing okay. Nice. Nice landing. Why am I why do Thank I have my landing gear down? What the hell? <laughs> Ship looks so cool when it takes the landing gear out, especially really see the caterpillar ness. Because <laughs> yeah, it's got so many freaking legs. Yeah. <laughs> It looks so cool. Probably one of the cooler looking ships in this this game. Do you like the Drake style then? I like them all, honestly. Drake style is really cool though. I like the I Cutlass as well. Cutlass is awesome. I like the Corsair. Oof. A uh, little bit forward, a little bit forward. So my snack for today is a oh. Turkish treat. Stop it, stop it, stop it. A Turkish what? My snack for today is a Turkish treat. It's like a, a cake. It's a pastry. They have really good okay. pastries here. It's like a sugar uh, syrup filled yeah. pastry. You can't really That's see it that well. Yeah. Oh, it is good. so good though. This is like if baklava yeah. wasn't layers, it was just a cake. It's so are you, good. Are you in Turkey right now? Yeah, I live in Turkey. Wow. All right, we got Deadeye in here. Um, just hopped in. Uh, another newcomer to the game. He's gonna meet up with us. Cool, welcome. Thanks, I'm gonna attempt to meet up if I don't uh, crash my ship again. <laughs> <laughs> we can pick it you up if you need. Right. Your name no, it's on... fine, that should be good. Okay, All right, so are we I'm ready sending... to get moving? Am I sending, I'm sending you how much? Oh, wait, why does it say, oh, I only have 33,000 right. left. Did I, so uh, go ahead and add me in the main menu, uh, search for space tomato and send me a friend request and I'll add you to the party. No problem. I've, uh, unfortunately, it's only installed on a hard drive, so it's a bit while to load, so I'll let you know, guys know what I'm in. All right. <clears throat> Whoa, where'd you guys go? I had trouble installing it on my, on my SSD. For, it wouldn't let me, it wouldn't verify the files for some reason. I tried like four or five times, but Oh, oh, that's I, not good. It, I know why. I, I know what's happening. So it, you, your SSD is your external hard, is your secondary hard yeah. drive, right? 
So yeah. this game, it really fucking sucks, but you you can install it to your D drive, but you have to do it a very specific way. And I just like you have to you have to make sure that your file that the file uh, oh. But basically you should food. install it on your <laughs> OS drive and if at all possible you should switch your OS onto your SSD if you can do that. Sounds like fun. Was there anything in particular you wanted to try? Yo. Um, I've tried most uh, things except um, like the big cool cargo runs. I mean, okay. I tried a little bit of dogfight. I played a lot of Elite Dangerous, so um, the dogfighting came a little bit natural. But and I've tried some uh, first-person stuff. Okay. I don't know. Just trying to sort of. I don't know really what I'm trying to do. It's just, it's just a bit of fun. Space tomato is just like I'm yeah, out. Yeah, being a space man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out. Um, okay, well, if you want to... I'm happy to, I'm happy to do whatever. All right, uh, go ahead and add me, and I'll add you to the party, and we'll come pick you up, and you can join us. Sweet. Aerialist, hey, thank you, you for the are... gift to set, my man. If we're going to do some combat one, missions one more later, maybe we, we have five. We could all get in the hammerhead and do some crazy shit. Yeah, that's really fun to do. Zen Ma, <laughs> Zen Na, so welcome to the, the uh, sub club, so buddy. Easy. It's funny. And so thank you again, Aerialist, for like helping the community ship. pushing us closer to that fifteen dollar giveaway. Like a, the big shit, like, can you have like more crew? Yeah, like doing turrets and things like that, man. Yeah, yeah that, that ship has like six turrets on it that can all be individually manned. Yeah. That was That's, that was the idea. Yeah, it's literally That's a gunboat. <laughs> yeah, it's like a like a pirate, like a galleon or like a brig. It's like a, <laughs> it has like two sets of like broadside turrets and like it's it's massive. It's massive. Yeah, Hurston is not spawn for me. I don't see the whole planet. <laughs> I can see through the space. The uh, what? <laughs> It'll yeah. load in. No, no. Yeah, now it's, it's correct. Now it's just done. Wait, give it a good minute. Yeah. Did it give me the same fucking landing? Vector oh, you're doing some Minecraft to... stuff. That that you guys oh, that's, that's pretty cool. Absolutely massive. Oh, we're in a caterpillar. caterpillar. Yeah. Yeah, is it's that like huge. A specific ship? It's, uh, yeah, it's for shipping and trading, that kind of nice. stuff, yeah. And people don't want to admit it, but it's a very popular pirate ship. Okay. So, got you in front of me, Kral. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look at that, they're closing the landing pad. Okay. Uh yeah, isn't that nice to them? What else is new? <laughs> I was good to know that you just have to hail them again. I, I last time I just fucking got pissed off and okay. left it on top. They gave me a, a right <laughs> approach. Damn it! I have to go all the way to the other side. I have a couple edits so to make, to hoping to get it posted today. Dude, I'm gonna check it out. I'm gonna check it out when you post it. Which I will keep I an eye out. Right now? Uh, yeah, there's something that uh, Elite Dangerous does, and it will be very good for them to have it here. It's like on your radar, you can see the when you're on landing mode or something like that. Uh, you can see where uh, your ship is uh, compared yeah. with the landing. That that yeah, they're working cool. on it. Yeah, that will be very, very good. The no, game used cool. to have it, actually. Yeah. Uh, before 3.0 back in 2016. Yeah, they took it out because they were transitioning to a different UI system. Um, yeah. So the building blocks thing that they've been using to build all these new systems the last year, they are working with it for 3D, um, 3D elements like the star map and stuff like that. So eventually, hopefully within the next couple years, I think within the next maybe four or five patches, uh, oh. they should have a new 3D landing assist. Yeah. What, are the, what are the patches like for this game? Is it are they quite good patches or? Does it uh, you'll find that people are pretty split on that. It it the patches have been a little bit smaller the last year or so because they've really been buckling down and trying to do uh, mostly back end stuff, engine stuff, and stuff for the single player game. Um, okay. But the patches come pretty reliably. I mean, absolutely reliably every four months, give or take a few weeks. Um, and they generally add mostly quality of life fixes right now. Uh, every nice. once in a while, there's something there's something pretty significant though. I would say 2020 has been a slower year than average in terms of content per patch. 
but it's yeah. also gotten a lot easier to get into like i think right yeah. like at least from my understanding yeah and that's that's where the quality of life stuff comes in so they've made the experience better for newcomers they've made it better for like in terms of stability and they've made it better uh just to play as a regular game like playing this game even just a year ago as a regular game was just not feasible um at this point you can you'll get bored with it but you can do it yeah, i just like go into f uh, f4 and then go back out and like sometimes i have to gain some altitude and then it'll show me where yeah. the stupid fucking circle is no it was right on my right side i love how these Elevators just fly through the air <laughs> like they don't even they don't even try to make yeah. them travel through the ground and then up into the building They literally just fly through the air shoot through the window and like slam into the lobby <laughs> It's fine <laughs> It's cool it's good. I think I think it's, it's, good. it's like if you ever look at the waypoints for your ship while you're traveling by elevator they make no sense I you just like shoot that. three kilometers to the right, rotate, fly around, do a flip, and then land upside down at your hangar, and then you walk out and your ship's there. Like, okay, whatever. Looks like Speedy found his hangar. Yeah. Yeah, he hey. got that. I'm really nervous because I can see through the bottom. I don't want to touch oh, down. Oh, don't land yet. Don't land yet. I don't want to touch down. Come on. Oh. <laughs> uh, oh, what are you doing? What are you guys? What are you guys doing? <laughs> Nothing. Just hanging out, man. What are you doing? Uh, I'm just observing, man. I'm I'm just a passerby in this spaceport. I was coming to buy a ship. Now I see some children in here crawling amongst the hardware. And what kind of establishment are the Hurstons running here? Hmm. Hold on. You gonna do anything about this, sir? It looked like it needed some work down here. You know. Uh, look trying to make prison. Uh, yeah, I was trying to. Just trying to check out the specs on this new racing vessel. See, it's like right under here. <laughs> it looks like, like you guys deal. are just rolling around. <laughs> <laughs> I think I might be stuck now. I don't know how to get out. Uh, security? <laughs> don't worry, security. we're in prison anyway. <laughs> oh. Can't get out. I uh, just gotta run and jump. Run and jump right. straight out. Straight out this oh. way. Oh, there we go. <laughs> All right, let's so, go. Let's go make some money. Cool Jesus. <laughs> like, what are we doing? <laughs> we were waiting for speed. We were just having a good time. Yeah. Just rolling around. Crowl's over here doing 360s. Bro, I played a lot of COD. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like jack the DPI on your mouse all the way up. Do one of these. <laughs> While defusing the bomb on search and destroy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm, ex I'm excited to see what $130,000. Well, whatever. It's like two mil. It's like 800,000 right now. 860k between the two. All right, for the Laranite, I got 182,000. And for the titanium, I got 412,599. For the titanium, I got another 447,000. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, 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 overall. No. So that's... Overall. Yeah. So I got, I say, what, 645,000? In profit? Holy oh, shit. No, no, no. Just in general. I think it, that's about 150,000, 200,000 in profit. Six. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's 210 because you spent 430. Came back to 640. Well, plus I bought the, the Laranite. Oh, I bought, I I bought uh, a little bit of Laranite too. So with all that, I am now up to almost 900,000. That's not bad. I think 130. 130. Road to 1 million UEC, folks. We're almost um, there. Tomato, or, yeah, sorry, Speedy, I sent you 25k. Yeah, I know. Alright. Here, I'll show you the ship weapon store. Oh, you can see how big their I weapons could... are. I looked up this, like, stealth this stealth loadout for my uh, origin that I want to get, but I'm not going to do it now. 
I'm not gonna waste the money on it. Yeah. But it kind of looks cool, so you can do drug running better. You know. Don't do drugs, kids. Don't do drugs. <laughs> Always do lots. Don't do drugs. Just smoke weed. Wow, that's a humongous. Jesus. So these weapons are size six, and they're putting size ten weapons on the space stations. <laughs> oh oh hell God. yeah, dude. They are basically they are putting like half a Drake there. <laughs> yeah. And the difference is pretty like this is a size four up above the size six, and it's like I wanna say half the size. Half half the size, yeah. So that would be that would mean that size tens would probably be double. Size yeah, ten, I of. bet you would take up just like that it would be like plus here. the stairs. Yeah, yeah cause size uh, eight would be double the size of six. And size so 10 would be, would be like, double the size of 8. Oh my god, it would probably be like all the way, all the way over that. here somewhere then. It's probably not yeah. a linear relationship, but it must, yeah, the, the, the size of 10 weapons must be massive. Yeah. <laughs> god dang. Alright, let's get going back over to the uh, spaceport and go grab a hammerhead. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Uh, but see, now I'm trying to do it on purpose. Like, I know. Let's see. What? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? I'm going from laying down on my back <laughs> to crouching, and when you do it, you like slide around. <laughs> it looks like some kind of weird dance move. Yeah, it does. Yeah, we're having good fun, Jasper. Fucking wall, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this game is ridiculous. <laughs> I want to see your reaction to the Carrick, so we'll we'll do this for a bit, and then I'm going to show you that ship. Oh, okay. Once I can find the way in here. Oh my gosh, why can't I? All right, I know there's an elevator up here. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Cool, 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 cool. Oh my this ship God, is one of the prettiest so ships, to, the prettiest interiors when the power is off. The interior of this ship when the there's no power and no lights is gorgeous. It reminds me of, have you ever played Alien Isolation? Yup. <laughs> or like, you've seen it, it's like that. <laughs> it's basically that. Yeah, I've God, that game. Exactly. I couldn't finish that game. Terrifying. Oh, yeah, I played so exactly an hour and it. 48 minutes of it. I, remember. Oh, I actually just beat managed to my get bank again. I thought it was so good. I couldn't stop playing it even Oof. though I was terrified. I was I so scared of that it, game. I, I was trying to imagine playing it in VR. <laughs> oh, wow, this ship is amazing. Oh my god, this is so cool. Maybe what? I'll play that game on stream so you guys can all laugh at how much of a baby I am. <laughs> Dude, I'm, the same. I'm a complete pussy when it comes to horror games. Yeah, horror games are hard. Horror games are way harder than horror movies because, like, you actually have to control it. My palms stop sweating. I've got like the hairs on my back of my neck down. Oh my god! Terrible. Wow, this wow, this. Shit Jasper is awesome. in chat did play Isolation in VR. My man, you are a patron saint. I. He said, he said, don't oh, recommend it if it. you want to keep your heart in your chest. Oh, you did it. I was yeah, about exactly. to say, Jasper, I don't know what the, you're, you're made of some other shit, bro. Yeah, that's that's <laughs> terrifying. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm too much of a baby. All right, go Just ahead and head to Hangar uh, 2. All right. I'm going to be there to welcome our newest member. Can I come out of the other door, please? Or <laughs> Did it lock you in? It does that sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, there we go. <laughs> Decided to let me go. It heard my, heard my cries. Okay. I'm gonna go sit in the co-pilot seat. It'll look cool. I sh you should be able to hail for them if you're the co-pilot. That's like the whole point, right? Yep. They don't really have multi-crew gameplay in here yet. But that's one of the first yeah. things I hope they add: the ability for the co-pilot to do. All the calm stuff. That would be sick. I guess they kind of have gunner gameplay in. You can pass targets between the gunner and the pilots, but... It'd be really yeah, fun to do... It'd be fucking like, great if an elevator actually came when I called it. That'd be, that'd be pretty nice. <laughs> yeah, they take a while sometimes. 
I'm just literally pressing all of them, making <laughs> see if one comes up. A little bit to the left, a little bit to port. Yeah. Like a cargo stacking. Was... If they if they put when they put oh, the cargo like loading one. in the game, you should be able to do it for money, for space bucks. Jesus, okay, they want to scan me right now. We'll hang a three. Really? What uh, what hangar did you say? Sorry. Uh, I don't actually right. know. I was just saying hangar two as a guess. Give it a uh, go. It's hangar three. <laughs> hangar three, it's are you hangar sure? Three, yeah. I thought the yeah, it's okay. just zero zero three over there. Yeah, I don't know if that's actually gonna be the correct one though. <laughs> Excited for Fine, the whole mechanics. I guess we'll know. Yeah, engineering if repair guy mechanics. Right yeah, nah, engineers are gonna have such a heavy load when uh, multi crew comes in. I will be good to see three. male characters it's play three. through. If I have a good a choice, I make characters more often than not no, black females. I'd rather see that constantly instead of a likeness to myself. Uh, well, I'll be playing as a black male first. Are you um, sure? Then I'll probably be playing as a black female mm -hmm. second. So it's not much. No. And then I'll probably play as I don't know I think a might be Mexican three. transvestite or something next. Four times Hell size yeah. four freaking ballistic repeaters is insane four times size four times six so we have 24 size four weapons that we're going to be able to put on our targets oh my god dude. <laughs> this is going to be absurd yo uh dead eye and uh what's his face are muted by the way you can put the drink in ships but not sure. really in inventory screen that. menus yeah i'm I, I don't feel like putting up with the complexity uh until then all right, let me get us something. Let me get us something to shoot. Uh. We're going to do a claim jumpers mission first. Simple, easy, plenty of targets just to get a, a little warm up here. Lion, how did you freaking upgrade a ship like this? <laughs> this must be so expensive. Best. Mm, I'm gonna go jump in the rear gun. I'm in the rear left, I think. The lower gun, or do, where do you want the? We need people. To um, I will covered. put you guys. I'll most likely show the bottom of the ship. So all of the side guns and the bottom turret are probably going to be the best. Two point right, four so million to turret. upgrade, fully upgrade a hammerhead. That's wild, man. The front right then. So but you are like a multi to get in the combat millionaire, the soon, richest person I know in Star too, Citizen. Yeah. Yeah, I'll go get in the front right since we don't have coverage on that. It seems important to cover that upgrade there. You're a crazy man with all that money. But hey, it helps. We were just running your... Uh... Alright, targets are on. Uh, I'm entering the turret now. Get things operational. Whoa, these turrets are insane. These turrets are crazy. Hold on, guys. I'm gonna make another pass and slow down. We are going way too fast. <laughs> These turrets are ridiculous. Holy shit. Uh, okay. I'm... That's a lot of that's a lot of enemies. We'll be all right. We got a lot of guns. Truly. <laughs> oh my god, that's crazy sounding. AC-130 esque. How do I pin yeah. targets? It, it, yeah. Or mark targets uh, for you guys. T. Oh, I don't know. I don't know how to mark them. No. I know you can target with T. That's about it. What? It's using the number numbers on top of your keyboard. So it's one, two. It, or some of those buttons, if you click through them, you should be able to set target. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh These guys are up God. being just absolutely obliterated. One moment. Jasper subscribed. Oh, no. Whoa. What? Do we, do we blow what? up? 
Yeah, what happened? I don't Did know. Did they take us? Uh, the shields were up. Hold up. Yeah, we just I died. Think, Hold yeah, up, I the shields we were up. An asteroid. There was nothing Dude, in front man. of us. Well. What the heck? I don't know. Was there an asteroid? Yeah. I, there was no asteroid in front of us. Uh, it was one on the starboard side. Oh no. I did I thought what? I was running into something. I did not see any asteroids. Oh. <laughs> I looked down. I looked down for one second. Damn. That's that's my fault, I guess. I'm on that's that's on me. I, I'm a horrible right. pilot. I'm a better gunner. <laughs> <laughs> Set the try again. Oh yeah. Well, okay. <laughs> Did your subscription kill me? Uh, honestly, I, I I will take I will die for a subscription gladly. Whoa. So <laughs> that is uh, a okay. Thank you so much, Jasper. Space station. Oh. Uh, thank you for the subscription, man. And trust me, dude. Spawned, uh, oh, thank you for the posture check, am, DW. I just was but fixing it up right when you said that. Oh. Um, Jasper, you came in at a perfect time. We got some awesome emotes, away. like Aerialist okay. said, okay, coming yeah. down the pipe. Not and um, I'm actually going to start doing soon, not this month, but probably next month, I'm going to start doing some uh, su uh, some supporter-only private streams on YouTube. So I think that would be a nice little perk. Uh, I'm gonna also, you'll get into the exclusive uh, somehow, channels on our Discord server if you want to hop in over there. But so overall, good. just want to thank you for the sub, man. Guys, that means we are one huh. sub away from a $15 giveaway on this stream. Go. Stay tuned. Stay uh, tuned. I might be giving away some money here. So where you guys want to meet up at? Uh, Well, we're all on the same space station now. Are we? Yeah. Because we all landed here. I know I gotta keep my shirt on go -o. All right, we're gonna have a retaliator. Uh, we're gonna have a retaliator escort flying with us. Ooh, okay. Because they they don't want to ride in the ship anymore because they've seen how I fly. <laughs> 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 All right, okay, we're going yeah, to hangar three. That's interesting. Oh, and I am through the space station. Did you just I, I I I I think I. Okay. Alrighty, I'm outside, guys. I, uh, my my character was <laughs> too excited to get started. We can come pick you up. <laughs> uh, just open the. Oh wait, yeah, I can open the hangar door, no problem. Someone else actually. I have ultimate okay. power. I'm opening the hangar doors from outside. Allahu Akbar. Let's go. Oh, that's yes. you. Nothing in <clears throat> Is Redwater gonna come nothing. with us? Uh, Redwater's gonna be in the Retaliator. Wait. Him and Glion oh, will be in a Retaliator. Here. Sorry? This is a different, this isn't the Hammerhead. It is, you're seeing it from the other side. Oh, okay. <laughs> a whole new world. <laughs> <laughs> so, is are we on anybody else? Or? I think everybody's here. Yep. Redwaters is gonna go do another thing with the thing. So let's go then. You guys ever notice? You ever notice when you hit T and change targets, the little outlines on the target like actually fragment and fly over to the other target? Kind of looks cool. It's like a sped up version of what the targeting used to be. Okay. Oh yeah, it does. Yeah, that. That's crazy. Where? Oh, you're let's right. See. On top. There. Oh. You see him? Nope. Oh, got right, him, got good. him, got him. Finally. Oh, yeah, now I can I finally play my action music. Yay, action music. What side you have? Three targets. Yeah, the, the trail left. is nice. That helps. Two on the right. Copy. We're too far Engaging away. Target. Port size. Yeah, six and yeah, yeah. Six and a half away I am. Mm. Could bring us oh, excuse me. a little bit. Yeah. Excellent. They're closing. Orbital sentry. Huh, interesting. Oh, our fighters are engaging. 
Hey, belly side, you you guys should have contact with Frederick Erickson. It looks like our prime, one of our primary targets. One moving out to two K on right on our starboard side. Uh, yep, he's down. Mission done. That's it. That's it. Done. Hell that was <laughs> so wow. fast. Demolished. <laughs> All right, let's get a <laughs> let's, let's get another one up in here. <laughs> yeah. You do it for the the justice. Do it for the justice. Some dude in a Panzer. No, Thank you for joining nice. us here on the garden, my uh, friend. The, Hope I'm you're having a good time asteroid. watching. No, Hope okay. we decide to hop in one of these so, days as well. I don't know. Balbatrax, is that you? One? One, Were maybe. you asking to play? Go ahead and hop into the one? waiting room, and see. I'll drag you down here to play with us. See if I can pick one up. Nah. No, Do we're we're out here in the middle of nowhere, so we're not getting any. Anybody want to try an eight ninety? <laughs> Mm, uh, yes. Do we have? Do we have FPS uh, missions that or FPS weapons that everybody can use? I have weapons. No, I also have. I don't know. I drop a shotgun uh, if somebody needs a weapon. Dead eyes and pie. Do you guys want to do that, or you want to keep doing space combat? I don't mind. I'm I'm down for whatever. I'm just here to fun. To be honest. Yeah. I could do some more space combat since we're already in the hammerhead, like ready to drag him to go. Yep. All right, we're I gonna. Have some bounty missions here. I don't know. I if suppose you want. yeah, but we're all on the same ship anyway. So if we want to go land somewhere and do some FPS, we could we could just break it up. I don't mind. That's true. If we want to do space missions, basically we're gonna have to jump back to a planet area in order to get more missions. That's true. Could I we go like back the... and like just accept like three or four missions and then go do them? Yeah, yeah. How about we do uh, that? So... Let's go ahead and hop back to sure. what's the closest planet, Hurston? I don't know, let me see. Yeah, it looks like the closest is gonna be Hurston. Yeah. Um actually go ahead and Tolorial? jump Anyone jump over to that space, space station. station. Jump to the space station off our starboard. Sorry? And let's see if any missions pop up if we get near there. It depends on what FPS missions you want because they yeah. are they are area specific. And yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, no I really wanted, wanted, wanted to do something. at some point some like FPS on planet stuff because I've actually never done any of that. But okay. that's just you know something I wanted to do at some point. We All right. Definitely don't have to do that now. How about this? We grab a Valkyrie. We load up in a Valkyrie. We bring a hammerhead with us. We drop on a bunker. And uh, we clear them out. That sounds uh, fun. One may want to character as well. Oh yeah, for um, some spawn points. Yeah, boss. Shall we go to the to the station then? Yeah, jump to the station first. Let me just see if anything pops up. I have to buy some guns then. Yeah, <laughs> Glion, let's get the battle carrick in play. Okay. The battle carrick. Oh, battle <laughs> carrick. Oh, God. oh my god. <laughs> okay, let's go. Oh, it's lagging me out so bad right now. Why? Oh, wait! What? Uh, where are you guys on the bunker? Pad Looks one, like two of us. Yeah. Right now, so if you'd like to come, Pad you can. One. Pad one, yeah. Oh, I'll come. Ooh. I'm already here, so I might as well. All right, you should get on the carrot yeah. on the way back, though. Why? Because it's a really cool bunker? ship. All right, I'm just gonna go there then. Fuck it. <laughs> All right. The Valkyrie's also cool. This ship is massive. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> That's the reaction. Carrick. Holy crap. Ah. Have you seen, have you seen the claim? Man, this is huge. This Dude, is like about a three, There are about three big ships in the game at the moment. Maybe four, if you include the 890. But the three big ones are the Cat. The Reclaimer, 890, and the Carrick. Yeah. I think we've got three. No, you've got, all, you've got all of those. All of those in your inventory for the free fire. This is crazy. Uh, it's crazy. It's crazy. It's huge. Wow, this navigation room up here is awesome looking. Yeah. 
Oh, so it's too bad you can't see out the windows, though. You remember I was saying that like I have different, I get different vibes of different sci-fi things from each of the ships. The yeah. Carrick gives me strong Normandy vibes from Mass Effect. Yes, thank you. That is what it is. Yes, especially the star chart up here, really. All right, guys, really that is the timer. Look at it. Time to run another ad so that Twitch doesn't run them for us. We run also, this ad. I think it's just awesome that you have a four story ship. And then we get another one when, uh, to begin with. maybe before the uh, it's got a fucking elevator. FPS that segment. All. Just so that we're not getting them running in the middle of our action Watch pieces. It. See you guys in Barely 60. It has a door. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm? Uh, I got. I have an Origin 315P. It's actually really nice. I like it. It's a nice. Yeah, I like it a lot. Uh, uh ooh, are the only bunker actually? missions at Microtech and Area 18? Really? Oh, okay. Yeah, that's a cool. That's a cool looking ship. Wait, I have. No, I have one at Hurston. Glion. Ah, uh, here we go. Oh. The turret must be down, huh? Yeah, I don't know. It's still pinging. Red water is saying clear. I'm just shooting into the building right now. No idea if All it's right. helping. We're coming in for a hard drop. We're dropping? Stop shooting. Stop shooting. Stop shooting. I'm not shooting anymore. Oh, we're on top of a box. Yeah, the game, the character is absolutely amazing, Waverns. I mean, technically, science gameplay hasn't even been, hasn't even been introduced yet. Yeah, and they also need scanning arrays. They need uh, the garden. The, the farming game loop. Like, there's just so much stuff. Somebody just kill me? I think so, yeah. <laughs> am I dead or am I not? I'm dead. How did I die? Well, there's, shot you. there's no way an NPC just killed me. No, I think someone shot you by accident. Carry God, his if body. It, Get him out of here. If an yeah, NPC I'm took cool. me out, I would have been so annoyed. You can type. Oh, yeah, I'm like, what, wait, what are you saying, Waverns? <laughs> pick up weapons. <clears throat> oh, fuck yeah. Keep them because eventually you'll be able to sell commodities. I swear, if an NPC just like sought me out and killed me in a group that big after everybody was dead, there's just, there's no way. That just doesn't happen, right? And then pick up another one, but... This one. Rocket League is free to play today. Ooh. Oh, I have to download Epic, right? I gotta download Epic and then download the game. Maybe I'll check it out. What is that? Oh, I want my, ah, oh, damn it. So how do I put it in my inventory though? Uh, you have to hold F and look at it. Yeah, Stow. Yeah. Hola. That this is nice. That was beyond the SWAT team. That was I'm like gonna give them like a, a cool little okay, scene to come out of the bunker too. The drop ship I dropping in. Here, looking all cool and sci-fi and stuff. I actually have to go.
So, um... So happy that was free to PS4 players yeah, when it first I launched. Really haven't played real life the, in years, or Rocket. On the ship. Haven't played Rocket League in years though. Ravy Crunch. I take a little break. At least I've been playing. We've Thanks been playing for joining. For, Thanks for joining up here. <laughs> uh, at least four hours now. I've been on for four Church and a half hours. <laughs> it's been it's been a lot of fun though, for sure, man. Yeah. I, I really appreciate you showing me around, and I'm definitely gonna play with you guys. Uh, Mara, I'm 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 going to uh, say good night to you and everyone else. Thank you for having me. Yeah, man, you were great, great having you. Have a great night. <laughs> All right, cheers, James. All right. Everybody's so nice. <laughs> <laughs> it's a a garden <laughs> trademark. Okay. We have a really great group of nice people. What the heck am I landing on? All I wanted to do was give you guys a cool freaking view, and I land on this <laughs> stupid little pole. Oh, yeah. God. That, that is the it pole. Did look cool coming down though, it did look cool coming down until you hit the pole. Yeah. <laughs> is that the terrapin? No, this is the uh, Valkyrie. Oh wow, that thing is hella big. I mean, compared to the carrot, it's like a peanut, but. It's pretty big. <laughs> this thing is big. Yeah, it's a pretty big ship. It's a okay. fat boy. But it's a it's a drop ship, so you need it to be a fat boy so you can fit all the monkeys in the back. Yeah. Oh, man. It's a, so yeah, if I, I log out now, uh, everything is okay, right? Yeah. Yeah. You'll just okay, log so back guys, in at the last space station you were at. Yeah. Thank you for having me. See you next time. Have to go now. Yeah, man. Pleasure. Have a great night. So. All right, man. It was great having you. I uh, hope to see you again. We'll be playing again Friday. Same thing. Ah, same place. Sure. Same yeah. time. Uh, hope to see you there. See you on Discord, sure. man. You too. Sounds good. Bye. Bye, stream. <laughs> Bye. Hey, I'm gonna take a quick break for a little bit. Eat some lunch. I'll probably be back on if you're if you're gonna be playing later, streaming or not streaming. Oh, I'm Hit going to sleep. <laughs> it's like. It's it's ten thirty here, so I'll be going to sleep oh, okay. soon. All right, man. Good plan. All right, see you later. It's good having you. Oh, before you go, what was yeah. your favorite part of the day? Uh oh, man. <laughs> I mean, in terms of like, it was all great. It was all great. I had a lot of fun doing the uh, the hammerhead mission. Uh, but I think my favorite part of the day was just like the tour of the Carrick and the Hammerhead and just like just the, the ships in general yeah it's just, just like nerding out over the ships taking off yo I will say okay favorite part of the day was when the Caterpillar was taking off just watching the Caterpillar take off was pretty awesome it is pretty cool I think that's uh, that's like as a bunch of people who really love sci-fi stuff that's just the best part of the game for us just nerding out I what the heck why did I, I agree, fall man. down? I agree. You'd think that it, the best part is like, oh, making a bunch of money on the first day uh, or like that's all why. these other things, but no, for real, it was just looking at all these awesome ships doing cool shit. Oh, yeah, okay. it's see. definitely the best part. Um, I'm glad you enjoyed it, man, and hope to see you again uh, when we keep playing. We'll be playing every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and then like, obviously, people are always playing throughout the week. So, if you want to join up, the garden's always active. Sounds great, man. Yeah, thanks for having me. I appreciate you showing me around. I'll definitely sure. be online trying to get some money. All right, Trade man. <laughs> See you All later. Right, Good times.